11 big changes are coming to Hal Greer in the Fairfield neighborhood in Huntington. But first, developers want to hear from the people that it's going to impact. 13 News reporter Alex Wilkins went to the city's community opportunities meeting to find out exactly what improvements people want to see. Hal Greer Boulevard runs right into the heart of Huntington, but most agree it could use some adjustments. The lighting is really substandard and I think it's really kind of dangerous for small kids to come across the street. David Harris lives in the Fairfield neighborhood, which surrounds Hal Greer. That's why developers have gathered input from nearby residents on improvements all week and then presented those designs to the community. I like to see uh, more commerce, uh, particularly a uh, uh, supermarket. We don't have one in this area. There used to be three or four around this area and now there are none. The number one thing that people wanted along this corridor was a grocery store. So part of our market analysis indicated, hey, based on the rooftop today, you can justify a 2,000 square foot smaller grocery store. There was also a second aspect to the meeting called the Fairfield Innovations Plan. The city received a grant that will go toward housing and neighborhood improvements in Fairfield. We know people want to see some real change, some real action. So Tonight is the opportunity for folks to share their ideas about what we can get started on in the next three to six months. Community members voice their biggest concerns and what they'd like to see improved. We have a, a good deal of blighted housing in the area and, and it needs to be developed somewhat. We've also talked a lot about the improving the walkability of the corridor, make it, making it safe for people to, to uh, kind of circulate around the neighborhood. Respecting the, the culture, the history, and the heritage of the community is something we, we've been hearing over and over. In Huntington, I'm Alex Wilkins, 13 News, working for you.